Hey guys, Kingdom Builds here, and today I'm doing a review of the uh, LEGO Jurassic World Juniors set. It's the Pteranodon Escape, it has 84 pieces, its set number is 10756, and it retails for $20. So yeah, um, let's just r jump right into the review. So this is what the set looks like in its entirety. I uh, just wanted to show what it is for those of you wondering. But um, yeah, so let's get right into the figures. Okay, so first off we get this female ACU officer. Which um, ACU, for those of you know, who don't know, stands for Animal Containment Unit. They were first introduced in the original Jurassic World line, but I think it's the same printing too. I'm actually not sure. We do get this cool, like, scared face because there is a volcano blowing up, so that is kind of cool. So, and she does have a dual-sided face. More stern, like, serious face. Like, she's, I don't know, just very serious. But, um, yeah, well, this obviously comes down. And she's actually the one piloting the helicopter, which we will see in just a minute. But, um, yeah, that's it for this one. Okay, so next up we have the uh, male ICU officer, which is basically the same printing, except he does have this cool, like, terrified face, which I don't think I've ever actually seen before. It might be new, but I don't know. Um, yeah, same printing, no back printing. He's got the uh, helmet, which is pretty cool. But, um, yeah, so let's get on to the dinosaur of the set, the Pteranodon. Okay, so now we get on to the dinosaur of the set, uh, the Pteranodon. I believe this is the same one from the original line back in 2015, at least the same coloring. Um, yeah, so basically the mouth can open as wide as that. It can't move. It's two separate pieces, which I'm not going to take them off but actually I might just take off the bottom so yeah it's basically two pieces and this part just clips into that little hole which you can see and you just if I can do it off on camera whoops you just put it back through there and it does it like that but yeah it's cool gray red dark red which is cool and then obviously the wings can fold Pretty, they're pretty movable, posable, like that. Really, just depends on how you want to have your Tyrannid down. So it's pretty cool. Um, dinosaur. I know there's a new one, which is like a lime green and dark red one, which is really cool in the Tyrannid uh chase. So that's the next set I'm gonna review. But um, yeah. So this is the dinosaur of the set. And yeah, definitely a cool looking dinosaur. Cool dino to add to your. Uh, Lego dinosaur collection. Okay, so next up is the actual helicopter. So um, it's a tiny build. It's not that many pieces. It's got this spider web rope thing. It's got a clip so you can attach your uh, little walkie-talkie. The back here folds out. Um, I'm not sure why. I actually have not tried to sit down the uh, male ACU trooper, but you know you might be able to put him down or like a little box or something um the wings basic basic wings and then this little cockpit which is really cool um these are actually printed they're not stickers which i thought was also cool it might be hard because this is a junior set so um it just folds up like that you've got a little uh terminal thing right there I actually sat the female icu trooper there and um obviously the molded helicopter thing right here part of the base of it anyway got the little ski landing pad so you just land it like that but um overall small helicopter nothing too too miraculous for a twenty dollar set it's not bad but um yeah let's get on to the rest of it so um yeah then you get this little like terminal thing with an antenna it's pretty cool these are all printed they're not stickers, so you get like a cool volcano erupting with a pteranodon and it looks like it might be a watchtower, so this might be the kind of small watchtower, but who knows. Then there's like a little computer thing, which is cool, also printed, they're not stickers. Cool little plant detail. 
So um, yeah, nice, nice little build for it. So finally on to the last part, which is the volcano eruption. So it's a very small volcano, but you get these cool like translucent orange pieces with like fire on them. So it looks like fire, which is really cool. And I actually have not seen, this is all one, like the mountain brick. I haven't seen it in a long time, which is really cool. And then these I haven't seen in a while. I think the last time I saw these was in a Bionicle set back in like 2005. Um, but they were like orange and, or they weren't, they weren't totally translucent. They were like gray and orange. It, it looked like a vault molten rock basically but um yeah what's cool is you get these little you got two of them so that's cool and you get the uh whoops yeah you got that just put them in there so you get two of the molten rock boulders in total and then you get obviously six of the little translucent uh cones that go in them so yeah, overall, cool little rock thing. But yeah, let's just go into the overall view again and give our final verdict. So overall, a cool little set. For $20, it's not bad. I mean, the piece to to dollar uh, ratio is kind of bad. It only comes with 84 pieces. So it, again, it's, it's if you're looking for pieces, it's not the best. Plus, I mean, the dinosaur is what really makes it cost a lot. It's the dinosaur mold. Whoops. Um, I'm not sure how much it costs, to, it costs to mold this, but it's definitely expensive for it to be twenty dollars. But um, overall, it's not bad. You get some cool pieces. Those things are those translucent orange ones are very rare to find. Obviously, I've never seen these faces, so they're like scared faces. So if you want for your civilians or something or other figures, you can use them. Uh, cool printed pieces, so no stickers. But um yeah overall it's a cool little set for twenty bucks it's not that bad I would definitely buy it uh, maybe another one just to get the uh, figures maybe another pterodactyl um especially if you're trying to like make I guess like a squadron of these guys um would be cool but yeah guys I would definitely buy this set if you can uh, especially for the just the dino alone. But it, again, it's the it's the same one from I think back in like the Dino line back in like 2012. So I think this first came in that one. So if you're looking for a new color, you can always go for the Pteranodon Chase, which comes with a little truck, which I'll do a review on later. But um, yeah, guys, this is gonna be it for today, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.